We're going to track all the day's <laughs> major developments. And this big number catching our attention. Hospital admissions have jumped at least 15 percent in five states. Alaska, Maine, New Hampshire, New Mexico, Colorado. And Colorado leading in per capita COVID-19 case increases with 29 percent of its hospitals expecting ICU shortages next week. All right. Well, Dr. Ash, let's get into some new news, some mm -hmm. uh, study having to do with COVID-19, uh, the vaccine and uh, breastfeeding and, and pregnancy. pregnancy. Yes. Again, this is four million live births in this country a year. It's a special population. New data, interesting findings about the response during pregnancy and breastfeeding to the COVID-19 vaccine. Um, we have to remember also CDC and ACOG vigorously recommending vaccine before, during, or after pregnancy. But this study showed after the first dose of a Pfizer or Moderna series that if you were pregnant or breastfeeding, you developed fewer antibodies compared to non-pregnant people. After the second dose, however, then they were all equal. They developed as many antibodies and they did their job. What this study shows is that it is crucial if you are pregnant or breastfeeding that you receive both doses of the two dose series, Pfizer or Moderna, and it points the finger towards more research on timing in this population. And we have seen hesitancy in this population specifically. What are the vaccination rates looking like? Yeah, this also caught my attention. Uh, here in New York City, there's a virtual clinic called the Maven Clinic. They surveyed their patients. They found that 26% of pregnant people, of course, reinforcing what the CDC showed, have not been vaccinated, but they also found 61% percent of pregnant people didn't know that the vaccine was recommended by the CDC. Um, and nearly a third of those people who have not been vaccinated say that a medical provider actually advised them against the vaccine. Right. This is a wow. vulnerable population. There's the health of the baby at stake if they were to get exposed to COVID. So again, we want to emphasize vaccinate if pregnant or breastfeeding. It is safe and recommended in all three trimesters. All right. Thank you very much, Dr. Jen. We appreciate it. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.